Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome to the Arch Nemesis YouTube channel. Today, me and the boys are going on a trip to France. We're heading in. It's also a race. We're going to see the mouse. <laughs> I wish we were seeing them out. <laughs> um, no, we're not. We're going to Asterix, yeah, aren't we? Um, we're also going to Park St. Paul. <laughs> Lee is on another plane. Yeah, Lee's Wait, meeting Lee's us coming. in Paris. That's happy flighting. Happy flighting. Happy flighting. Happy flighting. <laughs> so Lee is a teacher, so he... <laughs> to, mi to miss the traffic, he got an hour later flight than us. He's actually stuck on the wrong way. <laughs> so we're winning the race right now. Yeah, this is, we're, we're in the lead. Well, twice delayed. This is crazy. So Lee has just sent us a video. Straight from the cockpit. <laughs> on it in the plane. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite easy to get anyone to fly back. Well, the plane's good to go. Got you all clear. And guess what? I'm winning that race. I'm winning it. <laughs> Mate, I'm not weird. happy. Yeah, let's go. My palm is bigger than this burger. <laughs> Mate, they don't know the difference between one and two. The difference oh, is, yeah. we get ordered a single, he goes, a one, a two, a three. <laughs> I ordered a double, I get a one. And we ordered an Uber, and we didn't get it, but it's fine now. I ordered chips. You going up then? Got a wedge. <laughs> they mean business. Oh, boy. No, it's a pretty good uh, double double cheeseburger that. You've been McChef. <laughs> and Nem's just got back from 20 minutes up at the counter. Cold as f***. Jack's got his extra large milkshake. Oh my word. And Dave's actually did have the, he actually did have the right order the whole time. Oh, he <laughs> found an extra burger in there. Hold on, clear. I've seen these on a hype beast. <laughs> Apparently, he's seen these on a hype beast. And they're, they're going for 24 quid a pop, so he's gone and found some. Oh, where are we? So, we have just broken into the Park Astro <laughs> Resort by getting through the fence. That felt like breaking and entering. There's no one here, and there's like armed security just at the random, front door. <laughs> random armed door that had to open like 10 years. Off ride shots of Tom Garden. <laughs> Take it away, then. <laughs> It's not quite Trinity, is it? <laughs> no, it's Trilogy. <laughs> Quick room tour. We've got... Mate, the tuck shot's getting sat already. Oh, you've got a bar. Yeah, mate. Wait, where? He's got a bar up there. Fucking Currently one drink. It? Love it. And then we've got a toilet here. Pretty nice. All we've got here, Lee. Sewing kit. <laughs> Shoe shine glove. This is a little walk-in yeah, shower. I'm going to sail away to sleepy town on this little... Free skits. The dance. <laughs> so we're currently in the outside section in the middle of the hotel. This is insane. It's beautiful. Look at this. Uh, it's quite beautiful. Yeah. Oh, cool. This is absolutely stunning. Do that land. Mate, press X to interact with this side quest. I just want pizza. Why pizza? <laughs> Jack Silkstein. Oh <laughs> 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 what do you think of the theme we're gonna It's lovely, you've got an owl on the wall. <laughs> Look at what you've got, mate. If you're lost here in Paris, <laughs> France, just pick up one of the books here. Let's have a look, Sam. It does. The Thorpe, Thorpe Park, the there we go. Park. Park Asterix, you pick up a book and you find one of the best parks in the world. Which? Thought Park Resort. Yeah. There's going to be a new ride out, isn't there? Budget Exodus opening soon. It's going to be the tallest ride in the UK. I'm really, really excited. Your Deeves. Where are we, bro? Uh, the Tromeo de Duke. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking soon, that dude. <laughs> oh! <laughs> what am I looking at? I just did the fattest voice break. So, we're now... <laughs> what the fuck was that? I feel sick. We're back. What a cool place this is. It's sick. Big seal of approval from the boys. We're yeah. gonna get Kip, and then we're gonna wake up, get late breakfast. Late breakfast, yeah. which would be nice. We're gonna scam the day with fast tracks and hope to get on everything. And then we're going to rooftop bar. Oh, yes. And I can't afford it. Switch. 
the next day. Today, we're riding to Tatis with Tom Cruise. I'm gonna numb all the croissants. Oh. Nice little character meet and greet offering for the hotel stay. Very cool. Good to see you, French Ben. Bon. So we've got Mini Montu behind us, but first ride of the day we've decided. Yeah, it's like a little Montu, right? I think it's fine. It looks sick. Oh, it looks great. I'm excited to get on Osiris later. It looks better than Nemesis. I can't vouch for that. But we're going on this kitty crate to start the day. Well, that was horrible, extremely rough, but a cred's a cred. Next up, fingers crossed, what we're here for, which is two tatties. Can't wait. Did you know the tallest point on this ride is still smaller than Exodus's first inversion? Oh, what a fact. What a fact. Wow. Go follow this guy for more facts. He's an up and coming YouTuber. Go follow his channel. He's up and coming. He makes some really cool videos. He follows some Exodus stuff. If you guys are interested, check it out. Thank you. Where are we, lads? Let's go. As you take me to the end All of these emotions I could to your head Feel your love is taking over Keeps on rising like a wave All of these emotions that I cannot So if you can't already tell from my hair, we've just come off two tartis and that was amazing. My favorite bit was actually this spike here. What a coaster, that was so quick, super intense. From vlogs and videos, people said that was, it was all right, it was a bit mid, you know, somewhere like a mid tier. For me, straight in the top five, what a coaster, wow. Wow, next up, Aussie Riz. I think we gotta go over there. I hate it when I go on good rides because I just lose my voice. How strange. How's the vlog going then? I know, you tell me. So yeah, right now, you like, subscribe, and I think it's been a bit too long since you've had a switch. Here he is, and he is guarding his wooden coaster, which we're about to go on. It's called Tonair de Sus. Bockies are going crazy. Oh, he's got the bockies on. What are we doing, boys? We're doing it backwards. Breathing oh. it backwards. Yeah. In the back. Sussy, backwards. Sussy, in the back. We thought it was an as well, but apparently not. Yeah, in the back. We've so moving that kit. So, as you can see, the back row is backwards. Fifteen euros is the biggest recommendation in this park. It's not going. Good be going. All right, me. All right, me. It was nice, though. Oh my God. Different gravy. Somehow we got on without having to pay backwards. It's an upcharge, but we got lucky. Very lucky. And I can't describe it. Nah, it's different. I've never done anything quite like that. It's silly. It was like an assault really on intense. the sensors. That was wicked. And I think like right at the start, it holds you a little bit. And then when you're off, that's it. 
that's it. Yeah, relentless. What what a flipping wild ride that was. It was wild. No, don't you f***ing there tell me that was good. Don't you f***ing there tell me that was good. <laughs> don't you I like it. Nem, nem, nem. That no, was ass. Anyone else have like a strange, surreal love for this sort of fencing? Mate, this is Tomb Raider 2. I'm in heaven. Oh! Choo choo, everybody. What a beautiful view of the park. Here we go then. There's a fucking goat! There's a goat! There's a goat! Review. Best ride in, mate. Well, this was absolutely fantastic. Probably one of my favourite family thrill coasters that I've ever done. Just when you're thinking it's coming to an end, you've got another half of the layout to complete. Such a cool ride, loads of great effects, theming from start to finish, hidden gem, huge. Two of them goo drinks. Oh, what a rubbish ride. I don't like this hobby anymore. Horrible. Right then, theme park and food fans. So I'm currently at the Tavern of Dionysus here at Park Asterix. And I've gone for a meal deal. I've got a baguette. It's a warm baguette. I've gone for like a chicken and mozzarella baguette, which looks lovely. A little bit too hard to grab at the moment, bear with me. But look what drink I got with my meal deal. Oh my goodness. I'm on the Beveraginos midday in the meal deal. I'm in heaven. This is wonderful. And you get a bag of uh, crisps as well. So, and it comes in its very own themed bag so for a quite reasonable price of 13 euros i found myself a wonderful lunch i'm very happy with that right i'm sat in this stadium place and i've got my beer i feel like i'm queuing up to to see fuel girls again or titanic yeah have you seen look at this oh my god the bobbies oh the feds oh my god He's got the Mona Lisa, mate. It's a bit different to the one that I've all the here. <laughs> So we just came out of the show. Very slapstick comedy, some cool effects at the end. Uh, not the worst, not the best. It was just it's pretty fun. Uh, I'd recommend it. If you want to chill away from the attractions for a little bit, it was a nice rest, a nice detox. And now we're going to get back on the creds. Pizza caves, maybe infusion and then steeplechase. We're in the Roman area, um, checking out the rapids, I believe. Oh, it does link back to Greece. Oh, big boy. <laughs> Look at the big boy. That's not very family friendly, is it? YouTube demonetized. <laughs> See ya. Oh, 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 I hate everything oh, about it. Oh, 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 oh. We got soaked on the rapids. Uh, we've got a few more hours on the park left, so I think we're just going to go around doing all of our favourite attractions, get on some water rides. Uh, and then uh, we'll head to the hotel, which is somewhere near Park St. Paul, which is the theme park we're going to tomorrow. So I'll leave you with that footage now. You already know who's about to come on screen. <laughs> What's he done this time? Here's another example of an absolutely lovely area in Park Asterix. Hello. <laughs> That's not bad. He did go, he was like, he was like, speak English, started talking about football, and he was like, oh, mate, do you want a big? And I was like, yeah. Believe it or not, that's that's uh, theme park jam, Ryan and Dan Barry up there. Hello team. Only down his drink when the floor is below because he's too scared. <laughs> Look how much we've all got, and then he has to. Oh, the floor's coming then. We just did a sky bar, 
extremely cost effective it cost nothing to go up there but you just had to buy a drink so it was like 10 euros for a drink and we had a cocktail and you get to keep free these cup. i would say it was fun i had a tough time up there it was really 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 scary uh because i'm afraid of heights when you're up there for a long time get me on a coaster fine you know i've done like tall rides but when you're just hanging up there and your legs are dangling and there's nothing below you i was struggling i wouldn't recommend it to anyone scared of heights but we're gonna bang two tattoos one more time and then we're gonna head home and by home i mean a new hotel somewhere in the middle of france <laughs> And there it goes. I remember my first art through. <laughs> Nem has no theme park. Hold on. Wow, what a ride. So that wraps up our day here at Park Asterix. We're now moving on to a very exciting new venue, which we know nothing about. So stay tuned for more chaos. Two hours later. <laughs> Boys, get, 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 jump in the bushes. Is that what it is? Oh, look at it. The next day. Good morning. Today we have woken up near Park St. Paul, wherever the hell that is in France. And um, what are we doing? We're we doing a bit of shadow boxing. Okay, so illusion, mate. What do you want to be There's, doing? No, seeing, no, no. no, no, I'm seeing <laughs> like Dean, Gary Cox, Luke Farmer, Chandler, Amy, all that lot. They're at Fantasia Land. <laughs> Laura and James from Theme Park Jam, they're at Disneyland Paris. Wow, See, magical, where do you want to be today? Magical place. Where do you want to be today? Dead. Um, yeah, we're on our way to Park St. Paul. It's got like one decent cred. The rest are all just like random pop-up temporary rides. It's the retro squad, the park. Where do you want to be today, bro? Disneyland. Are you more of a lift hills or launches type of guy? Coty Branya. <laughs> it's a lovely hotel. We're here! First, you go through this security section. Really, and really strict, I think, this one. Lee, let, let's... I think, I think this one's going to be fine. Okay, You're let's right, see mate. what he says. You're all right, uh, you should swing on this. Uh... Bag check. This is the best shot I've ever taken in my life. <laughs> la, 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 la. So we've done our first cred here at Park St. Paul's. And it's nice, they've, they've made the support into a little seating system so you can have a little picnic here in, in the ride area. Brilliant. Again, again, again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it feels like we've got swimming trunks on. It's not like any of us have a whole life in our bag. Nice little plus one, that. Did you enjoy it? Says it all. Yeah. Fair play, Park St. Paul. Fair fucking play. It looks great. Wood Express. Do you want to hold this wood? It's stuff like this that, that really scares me. Really, really. Well, the wild train lived up to its name. That was scary. That was bad. I oh, love a tunnel going up the lift hill coming out. Oh, hey. Yeah, the tunnel that you could touch. That's <laughs> <I think laughs> so that's, wrong. I've been our second best ride this trip. What? Mate, the drop was good. Oh, that was scary, that man. Was crazy. Holding on for crazy dear life. Well, I've never seen a chair swing with Pinhead, Jabba the Hutt, and Gollum on it before. It's spooky town. Awesome. This looks like a haunted house. Green light, green light. Yeah. Oh my fucking god, I'm not going first. <laughs> no! Fuck this! Absolutely not. Fuck this! Boys, this is fucking scary. Ah! I'm holding my ears, I'm so scared. Who's that? Who's that? Oh! Ah! 
It looks bad, bro. She bad. Ah! Caramel one, she bad. Caramel one. Don't move. She bad. This is oh, bad. So bad. So bad. I want out. Ah! We're good, we're good, we're calm, we're calm. Boys, it's not looking good. Three, two, two one, run it! Never again. I hate it. Oh, it's scary, that. Oh. Ooh, well. <laughs> well, it's safe to say we're a bunch of wet wipes, but that was absolutely spooktacular, that That's was. That's disgusting. Zero out of ten. Mate, I had to do it with the flash on. I'll say, <laughs> I'll say for content, it was more so I could see where I was uh, going. I actually held on to them and covered my ears. 100% of that, mate. I had the biggest bitch going. We were holding each other, mate. That was all. Best out of season attraction, mate. That was fab. I'd love to see something like that in the UK because it doesn't need much maintenance. It was great fun, that was, even though we were screaming like a bunch of crybabies. Just to put into perspective how big this haunted house is, you start here and then you come out by this big pumpkin over here. Lee, what did you think of that? What, the mirror maze or the horror maze? Horror maze. The horror maze? Pretty good. Thoughts? <laughs> See, that was a whole lot of the shit on me. It was really good. It, it was does. like an extreme maze. I mean, if they are chuck a few axes in there, that, that's generally it could be terrifying. Facts. But it was cool. Everything was only... caged away from you, but it still felt scary. I think that was just scary because things were clanging against the cage. Yes, so agreed. It was creating louder noises. Like, no, some good scare tactics. You haven't put that together. It's probably a passion project as well. 10 out of 10 from us. Park St. Paul as a whole has been pretty fun. We've just done the trampolines. That was great. Bit of a short amount of time on there, but look at this random stuff. This, I think, is the beauty of traveling to somewhere around Europe because you get the most random crackers things to do. Family park, but you know, you make your own fun from it. And we've had a pretty good time, so. It's been pretty good, I do recommend it. So we found this big top and it's got this cool volcano slide. It looks very dirty right now. It definitely is. Um, we've having, having a bit of a ball, haven't we, boys? Send it off the top. <laughs> Mate, got the crowd going. <laughs> Eddie has been going crazy. Acrobatics, this man has been full sending it off the top. Fair play to him. Here he is. He's the man the, himself. The English stunt man. <laughs> Sign the contract, and now I'm getting on my POV. Yeah. Cut to that now. Gearing up for the big jump. Oh. Oi. 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 Let's go, baby. Wait, Jack, might... oh my God, Jack can have it. Let's go. Stinker weather we've just spent a good hour, maybe more, just going up and down this little slide. Very easy to please bunch of lads. Also, should do the woody, you know, like, a half decent ride. Let's go to the play area. Uber's three minutes away. I've got fluff in my hair and our flight's been delayed by an hour and a half. It's an interesting part. Isn't it? <laughs> yes, it is. Have you told them the bad news though? Just said we've got a, an hour and 20 minute delay. Yeah, and I've booked an easy jet and it hasn't been very easy so far. It's so I'm a tough. bit livid, mate. It's been tough. Blue sky as we are leaving. <laughs> Trying not to be ungrateful. Very difficult. Boom. Cool. Au revoir, oh, Mark St. Paul. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's a goal. One to Arsenal. You can put that in. camera away right now. Saka so like chips it into the middle. Oh it's my god. It's literally first touch. Oh it's first my touch. god. And my man, it's a different postcode. Oh, Hi, vlog. How are we doing? Uh, We're going back to England now. <laughs> I don't think I've experienced a happier Jack. My dad won't pick me up from the airport. Oh, mate. He's been drinking. Oh, oh. brilliant. <laughs> Stu. Leave the sun at the air. <laughs> Big up, Stu. The homeland.
And that just about does it for this wonderful little two day uh, trip to France. It's been fun, it's been fantastic. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bonjour. Au revoir, Au revoir. baby. Au revoir. We're going home. Thank <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>